Hey everyone, it's Sarah Bigger over here. I'm here with my brother Billy, my friend Steven and Justin. We're going to be trying Sioux City Berry Berry. Let's just get down and trying it. Berry has a history of not usually letting me down, so exactly. I am hoping for a similar result here. I think you guys got to like this. You know how prickly pear smelled like a Jolly Rancher? Yeah. This smells like a blueberry Jolly Rancher. Does it really? Yeah. I don't think there was a blueberry Jolly Rancher. I wonder if it's going to be as good as Foo Foo There was a blueberry one, I think. No, there was a blue raspberry. Oh, sorry, blue raspberry. That's what I meant. It smells like a blue raspberry to me. Where exactly did blue raspberry come from? Because uh, I don't think there are, there's like a physical fruit of it. There's not, but whoever did it is amazing. Yeah. Because blue raspberry is literally like my favorite. Like, yeah. Uh, is it Mountain Dew Voltage Blue Raspberry? Okay, Let's Blue take a smell. Mm. Oh. I, I do enjoy that smell. But well, that smells really good. I think since we all love smell, let's just take a drink. It's good. Uh, it's a bit more sweeter than I anticipated, and I just looked. It has 48 grams of sugar <laughs> in this thing. So it has a lot of sugar, and it's a bit more sweeter than I wanted. But maybe I should have expected that from Berry Berry. Berries are, of course, very sweet. It's still very good, though. I mean, um, it's a good soda. Nothing wrong with it. It's definitely not as good as Prickly Pear. Prickly Pear, I think, is amazing. But I kind of just wish it tasted like the way how it smelled. So, I don't know if anyone else picked up on it, but did, they, did anyone else get like a taste of like a vanilla, a hint of vanilla? There was a little bit of vanilla kind of in there. But it, it's more of just a lot of sugar. That, that's yeah. what I was thinking. Yes. Yeah. It was, really, it's just mostly well, a lot that, sugar. That's me. It was like kind of pleasing. It's like it's really good. And I'm like, oh, so it was really good. <laughs> okay. I'm enjoying it. Um, I definitely did not really dislike this one much. In fact, I I am leaning honestly more towards the positive side of it. I do agree though that there is a sweetness to it that just doesn't fit berries. Berries, I'm used to having a a certain tang to them, I guess. Not quite like prickly pear levels of tang, which was like pretty decently sour. Yeah. Which I also really like. But, you know, just enough so that you know you're eating berry. Or in this case, drinking something that has been flavored with berries. And honestly, I just think it's overpowered by the sugar, which for the general taste is not necessarily a bad thing. I just feel like for a soda like this, different things needed to be done to make it the best that it could be. I'm going to have to say it was really good. I, I liked the sugariness. Um, it's probably one of... It, I would put it on t like the top like 10 favorite sodas that I've tried on this show. Really? Yeah. yeah I, I mean, even though I did not like the over amount of sweetness and sugar, it's still a decent soda. It's, it's more of like, I would say more of a kid's soda. That's how it tastes more to me. But I'm gonna give it, I, I still think it's a good soda. I enjoy drinking it. It's just a little bit over sweet. So for that, I'm gonna give it a 7.5 out of 10. I really enjoyed the overall flavor. I definitely could taste the berry, but again, it was pretty sweet for what we were wanting. And kind of a bit of tang would have made it much better. Like it would have pushed it right to where we wanted it. But for what it is, I really enjoyed it. So an 8.5 out of 10. 7.5 out of 10 for basically the same reasons that Justin gave it an 8.5. Pretty good. Just want that little bit of extra for my berry. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and give this soda a 8.8 .8 out of 10. I know I'm going higher tonight with most of my ratings, but... Did you... <laughs> well, everyone, thank you so much for watching our Tyler Big Review. Uh, click see him to see his movie review channel. Uh, click here these guys for... Whatever happens, you know, it's a mystery. Anyway, guys, again, thank you so much for watching.